Hi, I'm Wendy Huber. I'm a Pilates instructor from San Jose, California. And here with me today is my lovely assistant, Katie. She's one of my more advanced level students, and she'll be demonstrating the long stretch series today as I cue her through it. And she's all warmed up and ready to go, so we'll go ahead and get started. So Katie, go ahead and place your hands on the foot bar, please, shoulder width apart, and we'll place the knees in the middle of the carriage and your feet back at the headrest. Good, bring your feet together here. So the long stretch is a planking exercise, so I wanna make sure Katie's core muscles are all engaged before she presses up into her plank. So Katie, go ahead and squeeze your glutes, squeeze your inner thighs, and then pull your belly button in towards your spine so you have a nice tight corset feeling around your waist. Good, from here, go ahead and push up into your plank position. Good, I'm gonna float you up a little bit, there you go. Okay, on an inhale, she is going to press away from the bar, holding this nice plank. Exhale, squeeze the glutes, pull the tummy in till the wrists are over or under the shoulders. Again, inhale, press it out. Exhale, glide over the bar. Good, inhale, press away. Exhale, squeeze and glide. Nice, Katie, again, please inhale. Good, exhale, reach the body long for the wall in front of you. Inhale, press away. Exhale, return. Good, one more time, please. Inhale, press it away. Exhale, glide, long body. Beautiful, good. Please bring your knees down to the carriage there. We're gonna separate your feet uh, to the shoulder rest, so they're gonna be flat against the shoulder rest, and then the knees are about hip width apart. So we're gonna go into the down stretch next. So I'm gonna have her squeeze her glutes, pull her tummy in, and then Katie, go ahead and shift your hips forward towards the bar, and keep extending your back until you're in a nice, long C shape. Good, draw the shoulders down. So even though she's in a bit of extension here, I want her to keep her abdominals pulled in throughout this exercise to protect her low back. So on an inhale, Katie, I'm gonna have you press away from the bar. Maintaining this nice long C, good. And exhale, return, pull the abs in, draw the shoulders down, open the chest. Again, inhale, press it away. Exhale, good, scoop it up, shoulders down, very nice. Inhale, press away, nice long C. Exhale, scoop it in. Good, one more time for me. Inhale, press it out. And exhale, scoop it up. Very nice, good. Let's go ahead and sit back on the heels. We'll stretch your back the other way. Good, there you go. Take a couple deep breaths there. You doing okay? Good. All right, we're gonna go into the next exercise in this series, which is the upstretch. So uh, this is really a three-part exercise. If you think of it as being uh, broken up into three steps, I think it's a lot easier to grasp. So I'm gonna start you with step one. So I'm gonna have you go ahead and take your hips up to the ceiling, and we're gonna take the toes back to the shoulder rest, heels braced against the shoulder rest. Take your head through your arms, and then pull the tummy in and round the back. Very nice, good. So here we are in step one. Step two, I'm gonna have Katie press into a neutral spine plank. Step three, she's gonna then glide that plank over the bar until her shoulders are over her wrists. Good, and again, let's pike it up. Take the head through, belly in. Press the carriage away, inhale, exhale, glide the shoulders over the wrists, good. And again, head through, hips up. Hold on to the abs, good, glide it over the bar, long head and neck, one more time. Head through, good, plank it out, glide over the bar, very nice. Good, Katie, go ahead and bring your knees down. Let's give the wrists a little shake out there. It's a lot of work on the wrists. Good, and then our next exercise we'll go into is the elephant. So you're gonna be in a very similar position. I'm gonna have you still have your hands on the foot bar, and we're gonna have the hips up to the ceiling, but the feet are flat this time. Good, so the heels are against the shoulder rest. I'm gonna have you bring your head through again. We're gonna lift the abs and round the low back. Good, and good, you've got your toes lifted up. So I'm gonna have you keep your toes lifted like that, so that you keep the weight more in your heels and the lower half of your body and out of your wrists and your arms here. So on an inhale, we're gonna use the legs to press the carriage away. And on an exhale, scoop the abs up and pull with the heels on the way in. Good, inhale, 
Exhale, slow the return of the carriage as you come in. Good, better. Inhale. Exhale, scoop and lift. Nice, Katie, good. Inhale, press away. Exhale, scoop even more, more, more. Good, one more for me, please. Inhale. Exhale, scoop, relax the shoulders. Very good, nice job. Okay, come on off there for me. Let's do one more shake out of the wrists before our last exercise in the series, which is the long back stretch. So I'm gonna have you come back to the bar. You're gonna have a seat on the bar facing the risers. Hands facing back, good. So I'm gonna have you sit nice and tall, belly in, shoulders down before we even start moving. And let's go ahead and take the seat off the bar, take the feet to the shoulder rest. Good, so you're hanging in a nice, long, neutral spine position here. So I wanna make sure her shoulders are gonna stay stable throughout this exercise. So you're gonna really need to press them down throughout the entire movement, okay, Katie? So we're gonna inhale, go ahead and bend the elbows, a little tricep dip, slide the back down. Exhale, press and lift the hips, and then send the hips back to neutral. Again, inhale. Exhale, scoop it up, send the hips back. Good, one more in this direction. Scoop the hips, lift, good. And we're gonna reverse, press away, bend the elbows, hips back, press the shoulders down, again. Good, hips down, lift up, one more, press away, drop the hips, press the shoulders down, and take a seat. Good job, Katie. Shake your wrist out there. Thank you very much for being my demonstrator today. And thank you for watching. Again, I am Wendy Huber from San Jose, California.